Hello, book foxes. Welcome back to At The Book Fox Summaries, keeping books simplified for your busy life, one summary at a time. Today we delve into Victor E. Frankel's profound masterpiece, Man's Search for Meaning. In this non-fiction psychology, philosophy, and memoir published in 1946, Frankel, a Holocaust survivor and psychiatrist, shares powerful insights on finding purpose even in the darkest of times. As he famously said, when we are no longer able to change a situation, we are challenged to change ourselves. Let's explore how meaning can be found in suffering and how our attitudes can transform our lives. Everything can be taken from a man but one thing, the last of the human freedoms, to choose one's attitude in any given set of circumstances, to choose one's own way. This powerful quote from Viktor Frankl encapsulates the essence of man's search for meaning. In this book, Frankl shares his harrowing experiences in Nazi concentration camps and introduces his groundbreaking psychotherapeutic method, logotherapy. Frankl begins by describing life in the concentration camps, focusing on Auschwitz. The camp was a place of unimaginable horror, where the daily struggle for survival was a constant battle. Prisoners were stripped of their identities, reduced to mere numbers, and subjected to inhumane conditions. The conditions were brutal, and prisoners faced constant threats of death. Starvation, disease, and the ever-present fear of execution loomed over them. The barracks were overcrowded and the lack of sanitation led to rampant illness. Frankel identifies three psychological phases experienced by prisoners, shock, apathy, and reactions to liberation. Initially, prisoners were in shock, unable to comprehend the reality of their situation. This was followed by a phase of apathy, where emotional numbness set in as a defense mechanism against the constant trauma. When we are no longer able to change a situation, we are challenged to change ourselves. This profound insight highlights the human capacity for adaptation and resilience in the face of extreme adversity. Despite the extreme suffering, Frankel observed that those who found meaning in their lives were more resilient. They were able to endure the hardships by focusing on something greater than themselves. They survived by holding on to a purpose, whether it was a loved one waiting for them, a future goal, or a sense of duty. The thought of reuniting with family or fulfilling a personal mission provided a glimmer of hope, a task they needed to complete, or a responsibility they felt compelled to fulfill. This sense of purpose gave them the strength to persevere, or a sense of inner spiritual life. Many prisoners turned to their faith or spiritual beliefs as a source of comfort and strength. This inner life provided a sanctuary from the external horrors, allowing them to maintain a sense of dignity and humanity. This book with extremely updated concepts focus in the logotherapy, derived from the Greek word logos meaning reason or meaning, is a form of existential analysis and is applicable to everyone life in any situation. Frankel's theory is based on the premise that the primary human drive is the pursuit of meaning. Life is never made unbearable by circumstances but only by lack of meaning and purpose. According to Frankel, there are three main avenues to meaning creating work or doing a deed experiencing something or encountering someone and the attitude we take toward unavoidable suffering. The existential vacuum and the will to meaning. Frankel describes the existential vacuum, a sense of emptiness and meaninglessness that many people experience. This condition can lead to boredom, apathy, and depression. Logotherapy helps individuals find purpose and direction in their lives, those who have a why to live can bear with almost any how. Frankel emphasizes that the will to meaning is the fundamental human motivation. People strive to find meaning in their experiences, and this search is crucial for mental health and well-being. Logotherapy can be applied in various settings, from clinical practice to everyday life. It is a versatile approach that helps individuals find meaning and purpose, whether they are dealing with mental health issues or simply seeking a more fulfilling life. Techniques like de-reflection and paradoxical intention are particularly effective. De-reflection helps individuals shift their focus away from their problems and towards meaningful goals, while paradoxical intention encourages them to face their fears head-on, often reducing the power those fears hold over them. Between stimulus and response, there is a space. This space is a critical moment where we have the opportunity to choose how we will respond to any given situation. In that space is our power to choose our response. This choice is fundamental to our personal growth and development. In our response lies our growth and our freedom. By making conscious choices, we can steer our lives in a direction that aligns with our values and aspirations. 
Here are some key takeaways from Man's Search for Meaning by Viktor Frankl. This seminal work offers profound insights into the human condition and the quest for meaning. Every individual can find meaning in life, regardless of circumstances. This is a central tenet of logotherapy, which posits that life has meaning under all conditions, even the most miserable ones. Our response to suffering is crucial in finding meaning. Suffering, when faced with the right attitude, can be a source of growth and personal development. Having a purpose makes individuals more resilient. When we have a clear sense of purpose, we are better equipped to handle life's challenges and setbacks. Each person is responsible for finding their own meaning in life. This journey is deeply personal and unique to each individual, but it is also a universal quest that connects us all. As we wrap up our exploration of Viktor Frankl's profound work, Man's Search for Meaning, it's essential to reflect on the key takeaways and how they can be applied to our own lives. Man's Search for Meaning is a powerful testament to the human spirit's resilience and the importance of finding purpose. Frankl's experiences in the concentration camps and his development of logotherapy offer invaluable insights into how we can endure and thrive even in the most challenging circumstances. Immersing yourself in his narrative, you will gain a greater appreciation for the strength of the human spirit and the significance of having a purpose in life. Thank you for watching. Before we go, we ask for your help. Please subscribe to our channel. Let us know in the comments what book you'd like us to cover next. Your support helps us continue to bring you detailed and thoughtful summaries of impactful books. Hit the like button and share with friends. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. This way, you'll be the first to know when we release new content, ensuring you never miss out on our latest book summaries. See you next time.